Good morning, first grade. We're going to talk today about cones and cylinders. Yesterday, you learned about cubes and rectangular prisms, and we learned that cubes and rectangular prisms each have six faces and eight vertices. The cube has the same face, which is a square, on all sides, so it's equal. The rectangular prism has four of the same faces and two different ones. So today, you're going to learn about, like I said, the cylinder and the cone. Now, your book says that a cone has one face. And the video that I posted said that a cone can have two faces. So we're going to stick with the book. If you wrote already that a cone or cylinder um, has two or three, um, so if you wrote for cylinder, it, the cone has two, the cylinder has two or three faces, and for the cone, if you wrote one or two, I'm going to take both answers as being correct, because different sources say different things, and we're going to kind of stick with the book. So we're going to start with a cone, and the book is saying anything that the face can sit on and not wobble or move, because here our cone is sitting flat on my hand, and it's not moving. But if I lay it like this, it's going to roll back and forth because it's not flat. But this is how we usually eat a cone. Okay? So here is our cone. It has the rounded edge on the outside, but we don't count that as a face. Then it has one vertex because it's the only point on the cone. And then we have our flat face that can sit straight down and not move. So we have one face, which is the bottom of the cone, and then one vertex, which is the point of the cone. Now we have our cylinder. So just like the cone, the edge and the outside of the cylinder is rounded. So if I hold it like this in my hand, it's going to roll around. But if I hold it like this, it's just going to stay right there because I'm holding it on the flat face. So a cylinder has one, two faces. The cylinder has two faces. And are there any points on the cylinder? Nope. So there's no points like there is on the cone right here. So that means it has zero vertices. So the cone has zero vertices and one, two faces. So, or the cylinder. So we have our cone with one vertex and one face, and our cylinder with two faces and zero vertices. 